As you already know, in the fractional reserve system, banks create money. Banks save a portion of their reserves and they loan out their excess reserves. That money gets spent and respent and eventually ends up in another bank that does the same thing. The amount of money that gets created depends on the money multiplier. The equation for the money multiplier is 1 over the reserve requirement. And this question told you that reserve requirement is 0.1. That means that banks in this country have to hold 10% in reserves and not loan it out. This question also tells you that these banks loan out all the other 90%. So to calculate the multiplier, it's 1 over 0.1, which is 1 over 1 tenth, which is 10. The multiplier is 10. So any initial increase or decrease in the money supply will get multiplied times 10. This question continues, the central bank sells $2 million worth of bonds. Now the word sells is super important. This central bank is doing something called open market operations. When the central bank sells bonds, it's giving bonds to the commercial banks and it's taking money out of the system. That money goes into the treasury and is no longer part of the money supply. So an initial decrease in money supply of $2 million will get multiplied times 10 and it'll decrease the total money supply 20 million. And that's why the right answer is C.